I hate small talk. I want to talk about science, death, aliens, sex, the meaning of life, the lies you've told, your flaws, your childhood, your insecurities, your fears. I'm unique. I have depth. I speak with emotion from a twisted and dark mind. So no, I don't want to know what's up. <laughs> you know, most people ask how you are, but they don't mean it. I'm lonely. So lonely. With so much love to give and nobody wants it. Humans are liars. I guess everyone knows that. They say they care and they'll support you, but they're only human. Nobody gets people like I do. I sit in my corner, I let them call me weird, but I know their truths. I understand them in a way that they'll never understand themselves. I'm the only one who really gives a shit. Life is like a puzzle. When you start out, you feel confident. You're excited for the journey and for the end. But by the time you get there, you realize there are too many missing pieces for it to be worth it. The problem is, my kaleidoscope doesn't work in the dark. I feel like the world is an ocean, but I'm a forgotten shipwreck at the very bottom waiting to be discovered. I've noticed that as I start to grow older, I become more and more colorblind. Gradually, the red hot passion that I used to see in peers fades away. The soft blue kindness darkens and hardens. The brush strokes of pink and purple get painted over. And then, I'm just left with gray. I never believed in love anyways. My father said, love is like a fart. If you have to force it, it's probably shit. <laughs> Classic dad. That was when I shit myself in the Walmart when I was three. I remember it well. It was just a few weeks before he told me he needed to go to the store for a new e-cigarette. He never came back. It broke my heart, but in a real way, it opened my eyes. These days, people are so caught up in their own world, they, they forget everything around them. They forget the trees that grow brown and weak. They forget the wildlife that slowly wears away with each puff of smoke. They forget the true friends who wither with neglect and broken promises. And they forget me, the poet, who is the only one with the courage to tell them how it really is. <laughs> what idiots. These mortals do not know my pain and suffering. They foolishly think their own lives present barriers and hard times, but they do not know. I know what it's like to be downtrodden. How can they? They've never seen what it's like to be me. Thank you.